the upturned root plates of fallen trees disrupt the soil environment, setting the stage for new competitive interactions. A characteristic of old growth forests is the heterogeneity in the microtopography of the forest floor due to root plate dynamics. Upturned root plates form a significant fraction of bioturbation, affecting leaf litter and soil mineral mixing. Ecologists refer to this type of forest floor surface texture as pit and mound topography. As a tree is uprooted, it pulls up soil and roots, leaving behind a pit in the forest floor. The soil matrix piles into a mound converting the disturbed area into a nutrient hotspot with higher rates of decomposition and mineralization. The domino effect in the canopy can mirror down to the root plates and may orchestrate larger disturbances. Overturning root plates redistribute the thickly accumulated leaf litter. Litter gaps could be essential for germination of certain seeds. For instance, tropical tree seeds cannot remain dormant for too long after dispersal. This is due to a heavy threat from predation and disease. Therefore, tropical forests don't have a seed bank in the soil. Litter gaps formed by upturned root plates could be especially necessary for the germination of the newly produced seeds. The sequence of root plate dynamics has been well characterized on a temporal scale spanning decades. Throughout the sequence, soil horizons are reworked due to weathering processes such as particle fall, sheet wash, and rain splash. The remains of trees uprooted by windstorms are frequently found in European archaeological sites, which can be easily confused with the foundations of Neolithic dwellings. To avoid such wrong interpretations, archaeologists have studied the microstratigraphy of pit and mound formations in great detail. The disturbance of sedimentary deposits by living organisms is called bioturbation. The impact of root plates on bioturbation rates becomes particularly noticeable on slope terrain. The downslope movement of uprooted trees results in higher soil mixing. The upheaved root plates may break up bedrock transport soil downslope, increase the heterogeneity of soil respiration rates and stir soil horizons. Pits formed by root plates collect rainwater and increase seepage to the underground. These pits also provide microhabitats to moisture-loving organisms. Seedlings, saplings, as well as neighboring trees that are able to effectively utilize the uneven terrain created by pits and mounds will exhibit higher survival rates. <laughs>